<laughs> hey guys welcome back to my channel it feels great to say that i feel like it's been a hot minute it has been a hot minute <laughs> but yeah so last week two weeks ago i asked you guys to send in legging recommendations i haven't been legging shopping in a while just because i mean i was content with where i was at that moment and i was like you know what let's change it up a bit you know we've done the three hits kind of gotten to know me <laughs> and yeah if you're interested and did submit a brand then keep watching <laughs> hey guys so for those that don't know me my name is B again the creator of what to do be on Instagram I'll leave that at right here so today we'll be doing that little legging howl so I was confused I was like do I wear the leggings or do I not wear them until I do the howl? Is it supposed to be a secret? I just dropped some. <laughs> but I mean, I kind of did that because the idea came after I posted mine. So I was like, let's just do a legging howl. So I purchased the ones that people told me and it wasn't too many. So yeah, <laughs> I added some that are my favorites so far and that I would repurchase. Okay. So we'll rate them in terms of cuteness and squat proof. For reference, I am 5'1". I used to like to say I'm like 5'2", but I'm like barely making the 5'1 cut, so for reference. <laughs> and then I am short. Wait, no, I already said that. What else do they go by? Does weight count? Height? Oh, size. Small. There you go. I usually wear a small for leggings, and it's kind of a shocker for a lot of you guys. From what I noticed, people were like, what, you wear a small? Yeah, I wear a small. I feel like the medium has been running a little too big on me. So, I'm a small. But yeah, alright, let's get to it. Okay, so, we are back. So, let's go ahead and start with this top. So, this sports bra is actually from Shein. Um, I purchased this about five months ago, I don't know, from April. I'm not sure. I purchased this in April. It took a while, but I think it was during that time where everything was going on, so and so. So I love it just because it's so cute. Look at it. Look at the back. Sorry, this first legging is from Fabletics. The price tag says $70, but they do have this, I guess, promo thing where if you become a VIP you get 50% um, off your entire order for the first time so that was my case so yeah take advantage of that if you haven't already now these leggings they gave me life shout out to you guys for putting me on because I was high key like skeptical skeptical about it just because I don't know I didn't know what to expect because usually it's kind of like one of those ads where it's like oh get two for 24 blah 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 and I'm like oh I feel like it's kind of one of those things where it's like it's too good to be true but okay so take a look they're kind of like an olive green color, very fall vibes. This is the back. And then it comes with a secret pocket. I love these leggings because they are caprice. So if you're short like me, I'm 5'1", um, these leggings would be perfect for you because, like, look at the length, y'all. Like, if it's perfect, you know? Like, you know? <laughs> All right. Let's be back. <laughs> Alright, we're back. That was a little lame, but just bear with me. Okay, so these leggings right here are from Tarjay. Tarjay's coming through with their leggings. They carry Joy Lab at Target. Uh, I got these probably a year ago. Highly recommend. These are one of my older pairs that I already had. Um, and then they definitely are squat proof. <laughs> Super comfortable, they're super soft. Probably my number one leggings right now because they were only $17 because they're on sale, but they usually run for about $30. I just went to Target a couple days ago and it looks like their price their prices are still $30. So go ahead and check out Target and look for the Joy Lab leggings, and these will be it. Super comfortable, these are a size small. I've had them for over a year. I don't have any holes. The only holes that I have are from the leggings that it came with and it wraps all around the entire leg. Just adds a little more, whoa, <laughs> a little more, whoa, yeah. A little more <laughs> oomph 
I guess you could call it. So yeah, check them out. All right, we'll be right back with the next one. <laughs> All right, these are the next ones. These are from Fashion Doll. I got them online. Another recommendation that was added on the poll, and these were $19.99. Where's that? Yes, these were $19.99. Definitely a super cute style if you're trying to change it up. This is out of like my typical range. I usually only have solids, but this does have like a small scrunch in the back and then it has um, designs all over along with like the little tie dye feel that it has. Super cute. These are size small medium. So they do run from small medium, medium large, large to extra large and so forth. So these are it, these are definitely super cute. If I were to wear them to the gym though, these are well, that kind of legging that I would definitely be cautious about and wear some spandex under just to be on the safe side just because one, they are very white. So they are see-through and they're not squat proof, but doesn't take away from the fact that they are super cute. And like I said, you could still wear them as long as you wear spandex under or if you don't care about having your booty <laughs> looked at then do you boo <laughs> all right we will be right back oh wait we back with some more fashion dolls no touch dolls uh products so this is the second set or second pair that i got this is actually a set so if you spend two dollars more you'll get a whole set so it'll come with this sports bra and the biker shorts um only thing with these biker shorts is I think they were made for a taller person because, check this out, so. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, so yeah, I think it was definitely made for a taller person. Now, it doesn't take away from the fact that I will still wear them. Um, same thing, same material as the last one, although it's not as scrunched from the back like the last one, but it doesn't take away from the fact, like I said, that they're still super cute. Um, definitely a different style than what I usually wear, and the fact that it comes with a tie-dye top as well. She cute, she cute. And yeah, um, it comes with like a little spandex waist, waisting, majigger, uh, on jaw. All right, these are the next ones. These are from Adidas, right here. These are definitely not squat proof. If you're looking for a squat proof, Legging, this is definitely not it, although they are super comfy, so they're definitely for lounging around if you want to get comfy and you still want to have some leggings on. They're definitely really cute, like I said, but let me emphasize, they are not squat proof. Every time I wear them to the gym, I do make sure to wear black spandex under just because they are very see-through, um, which I kind of expected more, but it makes sense because the material is cotton, I believe, and these are size small. The length is pretty nice just because it's not crazy long especially for a person like me that's 5'1 <laughs> so yeah these next ones are from Amazon <laughs> and honestly I am pretty shook at how good the material is because ordering from Amazon is kind of more of like a hit or miss especially from kind of brands that you don't really hear about so I decided to give them a try, and would I repurchase? Yes, I would. They look at them. Like they're not tight at all, and they complement the body nicely. The back. I am again five one, so it kind of does linger a little bit from the bottom, like this. But is there any more room for me in those leggings? All right, these next ones are from. Adidas competitor. Do you know what that is? Yeah, it is Nike. Yeah, yeah. Just don't tell me they're on. Okay. All right. So these are from Nike's. It has a Nike symbol right here, and then it has—is it mesh? I believe is what it's called down here towards the calf area, going forward. So it's not all around the leg. I got these probably. I want to say like two years ago. I could be wrong. Quote me if I'm wrong. Well, you guys won't know, right? <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, I got these some time ago, and I love the fabric just because I purchased other Nike leggings before, and it doesn't feel the same. Definitely does not feel the same. These are super soft. 
Uh, they come with a pocket back here, I believe. Probably the size of a phone. Let's try it. Ah. Yes. So my iPhone definitely fits in the back with that pocket right there. Super comfortable, super soft, to be honest. I would definitely repurchase if it were this material. I know, like I said, I purchased another pair from Nike after this purchase just because I was so obsessed with this uh, material and the legging in general. All right, and we're back with the last leggings. So these last ones are also from Fabletics. I like the material. I cannot lie. I like the material. I like how stretchy they are. They're size small, six. And the same thing, I'm 5'1", so they're also the 7 eighths length. Now, <laughs> here's the trick. These, my dear, are not squat proof. Which kind of makes sense because this is a clear material, so you could definitely see this tag hanging in there. I do like that there's this big, huge pocket here so I could fit my wallet, my keys, my mask, my headphones, my watch, my water bottle, and, and my hand sanitizing wipes. Oh, and I could probably fit the bottle of um, disinfecting in here as well, so yeah. Like that pocket has a lot of potential. Let me show you. leggings do have a lot of potential but the only thing about them is that they are not squat proof but like I said before that's no problem we could always wear spandex under you know that's the neat thing about spandex and then the front is it the front so as you, from the other ones they have a line here right this one doesn't it's like a blank space Ooh. We're gonna go down the list again, okay? So, we're gonna go down the list. The ones I have on are like the lavender grayish ones from Fabletics. Those were about $30. And they're not squat proof, but they're definitely really cute. These are from Nike, and they are squat proof. They have the mesh in the bottom. Pardon me. And those, I do not remember the price, but if you know Nike, you know they be taxing or whatever. <laughs> so, if you're not trying to pay the Nike price, you could pay the Amazon price and get some cute, 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 cute leggings by Amazon. Well, they're not by Amazon, sorry. They're from a vendor there, which I will link down below. And yeah, they have different colors. I would definitely get more of these in the future. Other ones, Adidas, Schneike's enemy. Okay, these were a size small. These are definitely great for lounging around, not necessarily for working out, but I would not 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 select them for working out. I would just make sure that I have some spandex under. So if I'm like doing legs or I'm like bending over, my booty ain't showing. This next one is this set by Fashion Dolls. It's a touch dolls. <laughs> And these are super cute sets, especially the leggings as well. Something way different from the typical solid leggings that I showed earlier. And let's show them again. They have a super cute print. Like I said, they are white and very clear colored, so they are see-through. So they're definitely perfect for either one, lounging around, or you kind of want to dress up like gym stylish for the day. You know, throw a jean jacket on top with some sneakers. Definitely a great fit. Or if you want to wear them to the gym, make sure that you wear some spandex under. But you're like, you know what, girl? I don't care. Like, I don't care who's watching. So and so, I'm going to be reckless. Because <laughs> that's how my mama made me. Then do you go. All right. This next one is by Joy Lab in Target. These are definitely my top, like, definitely at my top three. Probably my top one so far. Um, I do think that they probably shrunk, or maybe I've also lost some weight, so uh, they definitely maybe stretched out a bit. But nonetheless, I'm not complaining, just because they're super soft material, super um, squat proof, and they have a little pocket here, and it's a super cute color with 
some little holes right here as you could tell just adds a little style to you mm -hmm, you know and I would definitely repurchase if my next purchase for leggings um, would be coming up soon I would definitely go to Target it was like 30 it was like 30 bucks well now they're 30 bucks they usually run sorry they usually run for $30 but at that time I was like you know what I, it was when like it first came out at Target and they're on sale and I'm like oh let me give them a try and I am completely obsessed I always get compliments with it so get yourself a pair and these last ones are from Fabletics they also come with a pocket right here you could probably fit like your headphones and like cards in here I don't think a phone will fit just because it's like this big and if I were to compare my phone it would probably not fit Let's see. Yes, well, it'd probably be pushing it. Like, yeah, and you'd probably be uncomfortable. So I wouldn't suggest it, but definitely you could carry your keys or your um, lock key or IDs or anything like that of that sort. And I would definitely repurchase these just because short girl problems, they are 7 8 length. And these are size small 6 by Fabletics. I love the material. I love how stretchy they are and, yeah, how compact they are too. So I would definitely repurchase. And then I already talked about this last one. And yeah. So guys, I hope you all enjoyed this video as much as I did. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> so, okay. I hope you guys had a great time with me. And if you guys have any more suggestions and if you think that some legging brands were missing, because I know there's like those big ones like Gymshark or Lululemon and so on. And other brands that are also rising really quickly. It's amazing because we have options. But if you want me to picture them or picture them to purchase them just let me know in the future in the next legging howl um and let me know your thoughts because i won't know unless you speak up so i'll leave that up to you guys and thank you thank you so much for everyone who contributed to the poll um or to the yeah to the poll and gave me their suggested legging brand because it definitely helped me discover new brands and help like small businesses such as like touch dolls and also be able to know what the deal is with Fabletics. So now I know. So thank you guys so much for watching. And if you want to keep up with me, make sure to follow me on Instagram at what it do be <laughs> where I post my workouts, uh, hits, I go live and I talk about mental health or kind of more so my my take on mental aspects such as discipline, motivation, um, commitment, and things of that sort that people enjoy, which brings me lots of joy. <laughs> so until next time, guys, be careful and please be safe and please be cautious. Get tested for Lil Miss Rona over there. And also, please, please, please do not forget to register to vote because your vote will count. And I know we're in this place where it's like well I'm not gonna vote because both candidates are out of their minds but trust me guys one is less out of their mind and we just want to get so we just want to move forward with everything that's going on and hopefully we could be that generation to continue making the difference because I know a lot of things won't change overnight but definitely taking action will be a major contribution from us that will be required in order for the U.S. to move forward in a lot of different aspects and I know you guys want a future here and so do I so please please make sure to vote and think about those around you who can't and definitely take it into consideration and yeah so please guys I'll put the vote registration down below so you could vote and get your ballot I already got mine and it's over here So make sure, again guys, please vote just because you don't want to be that person that says, oh well, you don't want to vote because so and so, well, turns out things like that are what create a bigger problem and if you don't think you're a part of a problem when you think like that, I will be here to tell you that you are. So I just want to be able to hold you guys accountable and I know like people say don't mix politics with business or with sports or whatever. I hear it every day, <laughs> but this is our reality and we have to do better, guys. So, again, be nice to the person next to you because you never know what they're going through. And always make sure to spread love and even to those that you're not the biggest fan of. Um, if people are being 
toxic around you it's okay to let go and you know still love them or to let go and not have anything with like any ties with them but just be the bigger person guys please i know who needs to be i know who needs to be reminded but be the bigger person it'll definitely come in handy and it'll help you reflect on your own characteristics and your goals in life and how you move so please guys move with caution and treat others how they want to be treated not how you want to treat them or not how you want someone to treat you because everyone wants to be treated differently and not everyone works the same way as i do or like you do so yeah a little spiel from <laughs> a lot of aspects but i'll see you later guys careful